Hello, I'm Jashikins, and welcome to another little vlog review, this time of the elementary episode, The Five Orange Pips. Kitty and Joan seem to reach an understanding by the end of this episode. Joan gets in her position from Sherlock, files on who Kitty really is, you know, because her real name isn't Kitty or Catherine, I think, as revealed by this episode. And so Joan is handing the files over to Kitty and saying, you know, I will not pry into your private life. I may not fully like you at the moment, but I'm going to do my best to show you that I can build a relationship built on trust. And even if I don't like you, I'm going to trust you because you have Sherlock's go ahead. And Kitty goes that, you know, why didn't you look at it? You know, just just look at it. And so it seems there's some friendship there. Some way that friendship can be formed. It's not that everything is going to be smooth sailing now. It's that at least the basis is there for both characters to say we can, you know, understand each other. This isn't to say that throughout the mo the majority of this episode that Kitty was uh, very understanding of Joan because she, Kitty is sort of jealous, especially of Sherlock's, you know, partnership with Joan. <laughs> She seems to think anything that Sherlock does with Joan is him favoring Joan over her, when in reality, I think at least one point this episode, Sherlock goes to Kitty that, hey, don't you think I just asked you to be there so you could get a greater grasp of, you know, how to do your future job by seeing someone I trained? who's, you know, successful in her own right. So yeah. Kitty is definitely jealous. She comes from a different walk of life than Joan does. And we don't, we're not really sure what that walk of life is, but it's definitely not s somewhere where she'd be in a position to <laughs> get, to become a doctor. So yeah. I'm really, really interested to see what this season does with Kitty. I'm, maybe Kitty will grow jealous of Joan again, and but no, I think that was really resolved by the end of this episode. And as for the whole big mystery of this episode, it turns out that Long story short, it was the smuggle drugs in a fashion that no one in their right minds would look. Because they would be looking, hey, this woman did it obviously because she was trying to stay in office. <laughs> or this person or that, or this person who's trying to get revenge for his child that died by th these faulty products. Nope, it was a drug dealer going, hey, why these, why this product is dangerous is because it's drug-like. And so I'm just going to get a bunch of them and sell them as drugs. So yeah, it was actually very clever. I believe Sherlock even remarked on the fact that, yeah, this was actually clever. <laughs> and that when you have genius, it... It tends to look in ways that others don't see. New direction, so yeah. My final thoughts for the elementary episode, The Five Orange Pips. It was definitely really interesting, especially on the Kitty and Joan level, and how Kitty's partnership with Sherlock is different than Joan's. And so it was very good character-wise, and I think that's 
the type of stories where this show really thrives because um, plot and such, it's it's okay. Well, when you have characters and the characters just being wonderful, like this episode, then that's really where this series, in my opinion, shines. And I have been Jashikin's owner at jashikins.blogspot.com. If you go to my blog, you can see vlog reviews like this. I recently released a chapter of SNN, which is my original science fiction romance series, so yay. Also, Jash Talks was really state, and me, my co-host Omar, and Decker Shadow just go, we go insane <laughs> talking about Prometheus when we are talking about the movie and not talking about how Xenomorphs would taste. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's the actual topics that are discussed on that podcast, then there's everything else. <laughs> and if you go to my blog, you can see the, you can go on my sidebar thingy and see where else I'm on the web and say hi. And if you are watching this on YouTube, go into the description and see a link to donate your account, then donate your Twitter and or Facebook accounts to my campaign. And until next video, goodbye.